slept as well, and I just got laser blasted by that freaking clone trooper. Okay. Hey, yo, what is up, guys? You just Rick here, and we're gonna be jumping into the Altera core on very hard. Now, I've uh, sadly I've already done this recording, but I accidentally deleted it. Yeah, long story short, but anyway, guys, a lot of things have changed since the last time you guys saw me playing L Sword. And shout out to everybody who was able to show up on stream to see that happen. I am now a Lord Knight character. And uh, didn't take too long, actually. I had a double EXP weekend and just had a lot of fun. So those of you guys who showed up to the stream, uh, appreciate it. And going to show off that that's a new skill I just got turning into Lord Knight. And um, I got a lot of help from you guys back on the stream. So you guys are telling me a lot of things. Basically that I'm a newbie and all that. Yeah, I, I, I got it. <laughs> but uh, moving right along, I this is a now old dungeon. I wanted to show it off, though, because it's one of those things where... It's, it's like the last dungeon of the area, and it's quite difficult, so decided I might as well show it. I got quest for it anyway, too, so um, might as well, and this will probably take a while, but what's up, everybody? Um, for those of you guys who showed up to the stream again, you got to see a bunch of different games that I'm playing right now. Uh, Swordsman is one of them. Uh, we got to play a few Steam games as well, and obviously Elsword, too, so... Sticking it through with these games, guys, and um, sadly have not been able to play a little bit of PSO2 like I wanted to, which, uh, if you didn't realize, that was the game. But, uh, the secret game, because of the whole DDoS thing, and that's been, like, killing me lately, so I don't know what's up with that. Um, Japan basically getting DDoS, and they blocked everybody else out, pers uh, temporarily, I guess. Man, this guy cannot get any more annoying. Stop that shit, thank you. But, uh, aside from that, guys, we have now gotten Lord Knight, got one new skill. And aside from that, really can't tell much of anything else because I'm still level 40 and I only got one new skill. So, um, guess I will be looking up which skill I should pick up next. And, um, on top of that, I've also gotten level 40 and job change on my Iron Paladin, too. So, two things happen. Double EXP weekend is, like, the greatest idea out of any MMO I've ever played. It's like, you've got to have that. Just kind of... A really benefit for people who are you know don't have all the time to play during the week and you have you know infinite stamina during the weekend and double exp events as well it's just a good idea so was able to capitalize on that tremendously but aside from that guys um this dungeon like i was mentioning earlier i'm going all over the place like i mentioned earlier it's one of those last dungeons of the continent i guess you could say or whatever this is region and it's it's designed differently, and you guys have already seen some of the hazards that this dungeon has. These lasers right here, basically, if you hit them, not only do they do a bit of damage to you, they can also spawn other enemies, so I've been very careful to try and avoid those this time around. And, uh, just, wow, I really hurt those guys right there. And, um, there I just hit one. Oh, man, okay. They also spawn these guys, which, uh are quite powerful. The blue one in particular is really, really powerful. And you'll see him later on, but hopefully I can try to infinite combo. You guys... Oh, I've also got new combos because of the job change, as usual. Basically a stabbing four-hit combo. Very easy to pull off. Just hold forward and X, and it'll just keep doing that. So I could just keep doing that if I was really lazy, but not as much damage as my good old jumping downward slash thing I've been doing. And this little spinning, rotating skill is also very good. Oh my god, okay. That's the one skill that I have to avoid, man. It's doing a lot of damage to me. And cruising right along. We are doing this on very hard difficulty, so it's going to take a little while to get to the end of this, but hopefully not too bad. I kind of figured since I'm a Lord Knight, I, don't like, I, I can do this kind of stuff, but obviously this is still a pretty hard dungeon, so... And what do I think of Lord Knight? I can't really tell very much so far, just because I only have one skill, but um, the, at least the people on streams are telling me that, you know, he's a pretty good class, teaching me a little bit about the damage systems in this game, and yeah, I mean, it's pretty cool. I really appreciate you guys coming to the stream, and hopefully those of you guys who are actually playing Elsword or interested in it can come subscribe to me on Twitch. I don't always broadcast when I'm streaming, but we'll be playing other games. You guys can give me some tips, and we'll, we'll go over the games, and... Uh, I have no problem partying up with people. I didn't really party up with on the stream just because it was uh, free XP weekend and I didn't. I was just going randomly. But boy, let me tell you, we got a lot done, man. Oh man, 
and just got canceled out of that school. These guys are freaking annoying, man. These guys are freaking annoying. And right now, I'm utilizing a lot of skills that have low mana costs. I have three skills that are basically like 50 mana or less. Like this armor break does a lot of damage. Same thing with the little rotating spin, the Lord Knight skill I just picked up, and the sword wave now. Um, I know that at least I was getting a lot of critique over the fact that Lord Knight is a physical class, and I realized that. And I'm picking up a lot of magic classes, or magic skills, like this flame geyser and this sword wave right here are magic skills. But that aside, they still do a lot of damage, even though I'm a magic, or not a magic class, so... Figured it was a pretty good pickup. I don't know. You guys can have your own opinion on that. But then again, this is my character, so I can screw it up if I want. Oh god, just got hit with that. I do not want to hit any of these like uh, security things. Just I don't want to spawn more guys, please. Let's use a rotating. Mmm, that skill looks so cool, man. Apparently, pretty good for combos too. Okay, well, may have just spawned more guys. I'm still not sure what the colors are. If the colors kind of indicate if I'm going to spawn more guys, or... There might be some kind of rhyme to reason to that. Ooh, just dodged it. And the reason this dungeon is hard is not necessarily the stage, but the boss at the end. And it's not like any of the... Other... Wow, I'm having trouble with this guy. Okay, it's not like any of the other bosses you fuck fought against thus far. It kind of has a pattern to it, and if you don't know it... Hopefully I can teach you right now because it could cost you. Not that it's the hardest thing in the world to learn, but just something you should write. Oh gosh, how do I how do I make this jump? Ooh. No, oh, okay. Still good. Still good, yes. Still something that you should probably uh know before coming into this thing, just so you can have a heads up and not take free damage. But cruising along, man, just cruising along. I just want to plug in some other games if you guys are watching uh, or watching watching am I making up words huh? if you guys are watching I did upload a few swordsman gameplays recently and you know I've been getting a lot of love for that game oh god okay this guy is real this guy is probably harder than the freaking boss just because of one move in particular that he does hopefully yeah you know, I kind of want him to do it but okay he might do it now there it is. Oh man, watch. If you're standing right there, guys, expect to take some serious freaking damage. Expect it. So, good thing I didn't get hit with that because I probably would have died. And I think I just got a message from somebody. Guys, if you guys want to friend me on this character, I am happy for that. Uh, Sir Rick. And I wouldn't mind it. Don't really uh, have any problem with that. If you guys want to friend me on this character or the other character I'm playing, uh, Lady Sif. Um, I, I think I'm gonna be sticking with those two as my main, but I do actually want to level up the other characters as well. Those being, um, those being Ad and, um, Alyssus I'm planning on leveling up too, so. We'll see how that goes. I'm not too sure yet. Mostly because, I don't know, it, it's not too hard to level up. I realized that on the stream that it was not hard at all to level up. Oh my god. And I missed it completely. That was embarrassing. And especially so on the double EXP weekend. Wow, this guy's doing some real damage to me. Okay, well, that combo was just ruined. And don't kill me. Don't kill me. And so it's not the hardest thing in the world to level up. So I, I may just continue the ad gameplay. I want to get that psychic maniac guy. <laughs> the the melee looking guy. I really want to try to level him up. And Alyssa's... Actually, I want to level up as well. And I just got laser blasted by that freaking clone trooper. Okay. Here he goes, back to life. I reserve myself to die a few times in this stage, guys, because I'm not going to lie, it's pretty difficult, so. Then again, you guys are going to... The pros are going to tell me otherwise. Like, Rick, you freaking noob. You're dying on this stage. Here we go, going into the final zone. I get to show off this boss after all that time. And I, don't hold your breath on me clearing this without dying, guys. Let's just... Let me, let me admit that right now. And the epic music starts. All right, so very kind of uh, let me try to explain this. Oh sh! What? I thought it was, I thought that was a safe spot. So this guy basically has these four cores, right? And you gotta break the cores to uh, initiate the main core, and uh, the main core is only up temporarily, and the main core is the only way you can dish out damage. Now he does large attacks 
like that one, that uh, a couple things happen. It will, if you're standing on the ground when he does it, it will knock you into the air. And obviously, like the hand hit me, if you're in region or range of the hand attack, it will hit you as well. On top of that, he likes spawning elemental attacks. Oh my god, like that ice one as well. So those are basically his attacks. So at least in this form, he actually has what? Okay, that was uh, I didn't I did not expect that. I am now squashed. <laughs> this guy is really tough, guys. Ugh. Okay, just make sure you jump up when he slams the ground like that. Cause whoa, and and got slapped the whole way down there. <laughs> The sweeping attacks are probably my least favorite of all of his attacks, but I only got one more life after this one to try to beat this guy. And I don't know if I can do it, guys. I don't think I can. But you must believe there's ice attack again. It's uh, one of four different elements, and they all pretty much do a huge AoE, so... Oh my god. Not doing a very good job right off the start. Okay. Hmm. It seems like on the different difficulties, he has different sweeping attacks, so... I don't know. It's hard to tell. Okay, but this is what I was talking about, guys. We did emerge the center core, and this is the only way you can dish out damage to him. He has nine bars of HP, so hopefully I can do some kind of damage to him. And uh, while he does this attack, he has multiple... Oh, shit. Get out of there. He does two things. He can either shoot the missiles and then shoot the main laser beam. And there goes the core. So, I don't know. I, gotta do I did not do a lot of damage to the core when that happened. Elemental attack. Oh shit, the fire. The fire is real, guys. You do not want to get hit with the fire. There's a sweeping attack. Oh shit. Well, how was I supposed to know he was going to go up like that? Sometimes he goes up and sometimes he goes vertically across or horizontally. Like that. Huh. I have no idea. I guess it's a guessing game. Oh my god. I do not have enough damage to break these things. Okay. There's ice. Get out of range. Ugh. On top of that, if that wasn't enough, he likes spawning guys to fuck you over. Okay, earth attack this time. Okay, that does a lot of damage. Get out of there. We got the core again. Get out of the way, you assholes get on the other side of this and then use one of these. Ooh, did a ton of damage right there. I know he's doing the main Kamehameha wave. Okay. That will like one shot you basically. Did a lot of that t damage that time. Okay. And another Kamehameha. It's actually safe over here so I'm good. Come on. Oh shit, I'm in the middle of attack. No! Okay, broke one. There's the earth rain again. I think it's actually safe. Okay, where do I go? Where do I go? Up here! Yeah! Okay, still good. Screw you. Oh, the fire one! The fire one's pretty real, guys. Okay, where do I stand? I think that's a sweeping. Oh man! Let's jump! Another sweeping attack. Oh, you see, he went up that time. If I'd have st stood where I was standing last time, I wouldn't have gotten hit. Yeah, that's hard. I don't know what how to dodge that attack, guys. It's kind of a guessing game. It really felt like it, at least. And I'm dead, guys. So, oh god, am I gonna make it? Am I gonna make it, guys? I got one life left. Oh man, I don't know. Oh, I wasted it. I wasted that skill on that. Bad idea to use that skill right then. Just don't get hit by the freaking Kamehameha. I got four bars. If I can survive for four bars, I'm good. Got the guy did missiles. Whew. Whoa, whoa, dodgos. No, no, get out of there. There's a fucking sweeping attack. I don't... Oh, he went up. He went up with it. <sighs> That's a frustrating move, dude. 
Oh, there's a core. There's a core. Let's turn this on. Oh shit, it's a sword. Get the fuck away from me, sword. Dude, do not get hit with this. Ugh, that was close. I just wanted more free hits in there. It was getting kind of risky. I think I can, I should be able to get him next time, guys. Jump, bitch! That might be a good attack to use. Jump it! Ooh, jumped it perfectly. Keep jump. Oh, what? Oh, well, now I'm a squid. I'm squashed. <laughs> okay, I should have my... F Ooh, this is perfect. This is perfect. I should be good to take out this guy next, next turn. Can I do it? Can I do it and not get bum-rushed? Right at the end here. Okay. Okay, core is open. I'm gonna use this thing again. Use it. Oh, I I'm already in it. I'm already in it. Fuck it. And got him, guys. <laughs> Man, that was stressful. Okay, I had no more lives left. So, anyway, guys, I know that took a long time, but I'm happy I did it. There's my Lord Knight. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. There's the Altera core boss, and I guess it just takes three lives to kill. And I will catch you guys. Boom.